turns out Game Lab can render 3D shapes, but it's a little bit strange. This thing is pretty glitchy, but uh, let's go through what I've figured out so far. A uh, couple things. One, uh, this reset and run button is no longer going to work. It just breaks as soon as you try to do that. So every change you have to make, you have to click refresh and just bring the page back up. Then the other thing is that you probably want to work in text mode for this because uh, you have to you have to repaste the code in sometimes. Okay, so if I hit reset and run, everything's dead. So what I like to do is take all this code, copy it, refresh the page, and then I paste it back just in case I've made some changes that it doesn't catch. For example, uh, here's our box. All right, so that's rotating fine. You can change this word to a couple of other things. So there's a sphere. Let's copy all this. And see, I can't reset and run to see the sphere, so instead I've got to refresh the whole page. And I don't need to paste because it actually kept at that time. All right, so there's the sphere. Uh, if I change the background color right now, everything's dead, so I'm going to take this code, copy and paste it, and refresh the tab. Hey, it kept it. All right. Okay, so now we've got it that way, and then there's one more shape that I've gotten to work, and that's cylinder. You may be able to find some more that work. If so, please let me know in the comments. All right. And now, see, my cylinder didn't come back, so that's why I've been pasting make sure I have the updated code. Alright, so there's a, a cylinder. Alright, so that's the extent of the shapes I've been able to figure out. Uh, let's change this number to half that size and we'll see if that's the one that can edit.